So I'm back, just had a sip of coffee. And what I wanted to say was this is sort of day one of really officially being in our new place. I've showed you guys on Facebook and on Instagram um, the house that me and Clinton, uh, who's my husband, um, are living in now. And I've left a couple of spaces um, free of, you know, viewing because they're not ready. Though this one, I'm ready to show you the space where Sacred Kingfisher's Creations is going to be doing their workshops um, every Tuesday. So this is, I'll walk back a little. This is the garage. I don't know if you can see it. There's the door and I'm about to open and show you their space. So, oh. So this is it. And I've got to get all this looking good by the 14th. So there's 13 members and these members are basically going to be their own board, their own committee, their own council. And we're gonna make decisions as a united group. So currently, we produce work for the markets and this helps sustain them a, an income. And we do things like these t-shirts, like the one I've got on. So each one of them has their original designs and we print make them and we put them on table runners and we put them on t-shirts and many other things like pillowcases and things like that. So I do the markets and I'm sure if you guys follow me on Instagram, which is brentking74, or one word, um, you'll see that, you know, I promote the markets nearly every week because I love posting and I love showing what these guys can do. So I'm basically, I have to do this room and make it look as good as it can and functional as it can. Now the guys have, obviously have to respect that, you know, me, Clinton and the kids live here. So we're going to obviously have some restricted space, but... This is all gonna be their space. If they wanted a dunk in the pool, they can, but obviously the house and any guests that are here will, you know, be still private. And yeah, I can't wait to show you um, where this goes next. So for now, that will be all, I think, for a good first attempt. I'm gonna be trying to put these into a blog on YouTube. Luckily, our oldest Brody, he loves YouTube, so does our youngest Drew. And I'm giving them the chore of editing and putting this stuff on um, onto a blog in time, you know. They, they're only 12 and 14, but, you know, they're soon 13 and 15. And, yeah, it'd be good to have the family all involved. So if anyone's out there and wants to just comment and tell, give me some advice of what I should do and how I should, you know, be able to show this to you all a bit better... Um, please let me know because this is my first attempt. I, I like to get it out there. I'm really proud of this group and I would like to put them on the map because, you know, the, the thing that I've discovered up in Broome is these communities are just amazing and they have amazing culture, amazing tradition, and amazing stories. The problem is that no one wants to listen to them and they deserve a voice and they deserve to be heard. And I'm hoping that through what I can do and what my family can do and help, that we can do that for them and hopefully grow our community to larger outlets and, and help more, more people in their recovery. Uh, like I said, it's an, an alternative way to look at recovery and I'm very proud to facilitate this again as an independent group. So we are registered um, as a business. The only reason I've registered it is because my goal is to turn it into an organisation and I want to show the non-profit side of it, that, that there is no profit um, for anybody in this and that if we turn this into an organisation, just to gain that trust of the government and of other people that would be considering to fund us and yeah, and I just can't wait to show you where this goes. I'm very excited and all of the, um, the group is excited 
and I can't wait for you to meet them all. They're all um, fascinating, amazing, special people in their own right too. They all have such individual stories to get us all to this point. Um, so, yeah, wish me luck on this last, on this mess behind me because that's what I'm gonna do now. And I'll show you little snippets of its progress, but oh, here we go. See you for now, and yeah, who know? Who knows? I, I like I said. I hope. I hope. Um, you all aren't just going. Oh God, what's going on? I don't understand. You know, who sees? Blah blah blah. See us.